Guys, we're here at NAB 2024, and is there a better time to harass a bunch of YouTubers and ask them questions? I think there is not. Let's go do it. All right, we're here with the one and only iPhoneo, the greatest YouTuber of our generation. Thanks, now, thank you kindly. <laughs> we, he is absolutely one of my favorites, if not my favorite YouTuber. You inspired me to get into this, so they can blame you for me. I hope you're happy. Come, come at me, come <laughs> at me. <laughs> now we're asking YouTubers, famous YouTubers, what is your current video setup at home or at your studio, your main camera and main lens? My main camera is Sony A1 with 50 millimeter f1.2 for the talking head. For the overhead, I have A7S3 with 24 to 70 uh, Mark II, the GM lens. And what about, and oh, go ahead. For the third angle, I usually use FX3 with uh, 35 millimeter f1.4. It's not bad when your third angle's an FX3, am I right? Oh it's, yeah, 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 yeah. This is YouTube success right it's here. It's just basic YouTube setup, you know. <laughs> yeah. Now what about photo camera? What's your favorite photo camera? I have an Hasselblad X1D, <laughs> and uh, I, I, I really love that. Well, well, I mean, who wouldn't? I, I know, right? Yeah, yeah, that's... All right, I'm going to go talk to people a little less famous, okay? Okay. <laughs> did I over, did I overqualify? <laughs> You're overqualified for this particular interview, yeah. But I started with GoPros and iPhones and my biggest camera back then was Sony RX100 Mark IV. When I got the Mark IV, I thought I'm ready to shoot Avatar. Yeah, well. So, so hang in there. That's true. You too can be iPhone up. Yeah. But you can't have that name though, it's copyright. Yes, we're copyrighted, yeah, probably by <laughs> Apple. But. So we're here with the <laughs> famous Donna Did It. Now, <laughs> the famous one. Quick question, okay. what is your current studio cam and lens? Uh, Sony FX3 mm. and the 35mm f1.4 G Master is my, mm. my main go-to. And favorite photography camera right now? Sony A1, mm. yeah, that's the one that's always with me. Fancy. Yeah, you heard I, it the fanciest stuff. The yeah. fanciest stuff. Uh, let's go. Privilege. Let's go, let's go ask some other people who don't have a billion dollars, okay? <laughs> I have Lee Zavitz, the one and only. Now, what is your current studio cam and lens? It's a good question. So I have mainly been rocking the Sony a6100, mm. but I just got the Panasonic S5 2X. Mm. And I've been using that as the new studio cam, and that has the uh, kit lens, just the 20 to 60. And shooting an open gate. I can no. do a lot of cool stuff with that. So yeah, that's, go, that's what I'm that using right now. Vertical video stuff. Well, it's just nice to have, you know, if I want to pan down to the table or something, you know, I have it. See, Lee, thinking outside the box. This is why we talk to you. It's good. You're going to get, a, you're gonna get a, a, a large range of answers. Mostly Sony, probably. <laughs> mostly. But uh, I'm rocking Panasonic right now. Look at this guy, Panasonic. All right, over here. Drinking a beverage, Chris Wake Brockers. Up. Waking up, this is early. We're starting early here yeah. with the questions. Grilling, Chris Brockers. What is your studio cam right now and your lens? Uh, varies, but right now I believe we're using an FX3. Mm. Uh, lens wise, you know what, I change up quite frequently. I think right now we have a 24 to 70. Um, I'm G just moving into a new space as well. So G Master 2? Uh, yes, G Master 2. And then the top down angle right now is an FX30 um, with the 10 to 20 because it's an APS C camera. Mm. Um, and your favorite photography camera? Uh, A7R5. A7 Without a doubt. That was fast. Without, yeah. yeah. Oh, it's the best one. Yeah. We're here with the fabulous, the wonderful Tom Buck. That's me. It's uh, the most liked guy on YouTube, in my opinion. Makes me sick how much everyone likes him. Yeah. Now, Tom I've Buck. Paid off a lot of people very well. <laughs> <laughs> what is your current studio cam and lens? Oh, actually, it's this camera right here. <laughs> this was not planned. The Sony FX3 uh, main lens, though. Sorry, you're gonna have to edit this out. No, we edit nothing. We go raw. Mm. Uh, Sony 24 millimeter f1.4 with questionable autofocus motor reliability. <laughs> <laughs> I will say that every time I talk about this lens. And what about photography? What's your favorite camera for photography? Uh, A7 IV. <laughs> because of its higher resolution, Sony A7 IV. And then I love, love, love the uh, Zeiss 85. Well done, Tom. Now I like you. Aw. Wait, I thought we were friends, though. No. I yeah. missed the mark. <laughs> I was, I was waiting. I was, couldn't end the video it's without a Tom just, Buck pump. Just right at the end, it goes in and smooth. <laughs> now it's perfect. San, Sennheiser just uh, offered us baseball hats. They and uh, 
and he got the mic. He, he got this thing on the, and we we're like, we're easily purchased. So yes, a hat. We're done. I'll say whatever you want. We're here with the famous Brandon Washington. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Super but. famous. Now, uh, what is your current uh, video camera setup? Your studio cam and lens. Oh, this is gonna make people mad, but it's the what uh, we want. Red Komodo X <laughs> with a uh, cinema lens of the day on there. <laughs> Uh, way overkill for YouTube. Well, I know I'm mad, so I don't know about you people. <laughs> I just, I don't, it feels like a flex. It's not really a flex. It's just what I have and it works and it gets Listen, the job done. And... He's he's not going to bother with the little Sony ZV-E1. He, oh. needs, he needs a more complicated camera. I just want one camera I can take and do like a client job with and then use it for YouTube and I don't have to set up multiple cameras. So okay, sold. Stick with I am buying thing. a red. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, make sure you tell Red and Nikon that I got you to buy it because they need to know that I'm out here selling cameras on their behalf. That's right. Affiliate income. Well, yeah. we'll, well, we'll leave a link I'm, below. That's what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting yeah. for the affiliate income. What about uh, photo camera? What's your favorite photo camera? Uh, right now, it's actually, uh, gosh, I sound like a like a tool. It's the Nikon ZF. I feel like I'm just like overly branding myself as like a Nikon Red fanboy, but. Affiliate links below. <laughs> ZF is a dope little camera. I like it, especially for like just That's photography. Cool. Okay, cool. Oh, they're opening. All right. Oh, let's get Thanks, in here. Thanks, Brandon. All right, we're here with the stupendous Cam Maggie. Now, Cam, what is your current, when you're in your studio, your home studio, what is your current video camera and lens? Oh, it's a lot of different things. A um, lot of anamorphics. Uh, the Module A L3 tuner, I use a lot. That's an adapter. Uh, the Sony 24 to 50. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot. Uh, A7R5, FX3, the Z8. Um, I use the Black Magic sometimes too. <laughs> I literally use everything. Yeah. People this... think I switch cameras a lot. I don't. I just I like to use everything. Yeah. Depending what the situation is. Yeah. You should call your channel Camera Crisis. Except that's that's my name. I know. And so you can't have that. Camera Crisis too. <laughs> what about what about photo camera? What is if your favorite photo camera? You want to grab one right now. Go out and take some snappy snaps. Nikon ZF. Nikon ZF. All right. Thanks, Cam Mackey. Looking good, buddy. Almost as cool as me. <laughs> We're here with the wonderful Sydney. Hey. Now, what is your current studio cam and lens setup? Ooh, yeah, so it's the Sony Alpha 7C Mark II with the 16 to 35 G Master Mark II. Ooh, what about photo camera? Uh, that same camera. I have sold all my other Sony cameras and I'm sticking to just one because I'm challenging myself this year to get super creative. And it's such a great camera to do both photo and video. And I am buying more and more cameras so that I don't have to be creative. So, <laughs> doing 85 Zebras. This, this is 12 800 though. I'm going, I go the second, is second that the ISO, ISO? yeah, Sony. and then do the F5, see, and that yeah, way, yeah, 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 get us all. There you go. Genius. Okay, so we're here with Fancy Patrick Tomaso. It's me. My actual, my, my real name is Fancy Patrick Tomaso. <laughs> now, what are you using as your main studio cam and lens? My main studio camera is the Sony A7 IV, usually with a 16 to 28 Sigma, the 2.8. Oh, and yeah. what about photo camera? Photo camera, still the A7 IV usually, but right now I'm playing with the uh, X106. Oh, fancy, fun. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's what we're going A7 IV fancy. all the way, I love the A7 IV. Yeah, it can do everything, it right? It can literally do everything, it especially if you're in a YouTube studio. Not to sound like Gerald and Dunn, because he always says it, but if you're on sticks, I don't think there's a better talking head camera. Oversampled, what is it, 7K? Yeah. Right? And I, this is controversial. Ready? I think the a7 IV has the best sensor out on the market right now for color out of all the Sony models. Oh, you it's hear a, that? It's a little bit different than the rest of them. It is. But I think it's better, I, it personally, subjectively. Now, that's we're talking to you, ZV-E1, that we're yeah, looking yeah, at yeah. right now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? No, it is. This is see, very practical answer. Absolutely. As you can do it all can with the a7. You heard it here. Except taking pictures then that's the Fuji. Yeah, yeah, that's the Fuji. <laughs> so we're here with the very tall Jake Sloan. I, everybody says that. Every time they meet me, it's like, wow, you're much taller than I thought. So I don't know if I put my camera too high when I'm filming or... Mm. Yeah, uh, no, it's just right. You're, you're much taller than I thought and, and so much more handsome. My goodness. <laughs> Can't take my eyes off. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Now, you're very kind. The question we're asking the people, the content creators, is uh, what is your studio cam setup and lens setup right now? Studio cam server is FX6 with a 24 millimeter G Master 1.4. And then uh, overhead camera is a A7S III with a 35 millimeter G Master 1.4. And those cameras will make you look shorter on YouTube than in person. Absolutely. What about photo camera? Photo camera is a Sony Alpha 1 with a 24 to 105 F4 most of the time, honestly. Unless I'm shooting wildlife, then I go the 100 to 400. 
uh, G Master. That's some pretty fancy gear, Jake. It is. It's taken me like eight years to work my way up to that gear. Oh, yeah. I started with an A7 III and a Tamron 28 to 75, which is a fantastic combo. Great camera if you want to do photo and video stuff. Great hybrid camera. Um, and then just slowly, as I was able to bring more income in with a business and just work my way up to it. I ended up now where I'm, yeah, at the Alpha One, which I never thought I would be there because yeah. it's a crazy camera, uh, and it's amazing, but it's it's also super expensive. So I yeah. feel very it, lucky. It took me about three months to get to the same level, so <laughs> you know. But to each his own. Everyone well, has their I own mean, journey. The way your channel goes, I could totally see that happening in three months. So <laughs> yeah, thanks, Jake. Thank you. Oh, my exposure is perfect. Oh my God, I'm amazing. Okay, Kofi, what Good is you yeah. <laughs> just this? He's, he's a professional. He knows how to use a microphone. Now, what is your current video setup at home, studio setup? See, that's a loaded question. I have 11 cameras. Um, let's, let's just pick the main one right. One, one the one that is at my house right now is yeah. an A7C2 hooked up onto oh. my house. And like that's because it's a one camera in my setup where I could leave it there. Yeah. And, and that, that'll just stay there. Everything else I'll take outside. I'll just leave that one at home so I don't have to worry about taking it on and taking it off. A7C2. Yeah. And the lens? Uh, 16 to 35 f4. Oh, really? Yeah. yeah the new power zoom? Basically, because like, I have a big window, and that's basically my key light, and I kind of have some direction. So at f4 with daylight, I'm like, it's, it's, it's more than enough. And if it gets to nighttime, I just turn my lights up. And what about uh, photo camera? I actually have. I actually didn't have a photo camera until recently, which was the A7C2 when I needed it. Mm. But I have been using the GFX100 Mark II mm. for the last week. I might need to save some money, but I think that might be the guy. Nice. But also, I'm trying out this Panasonic S5X2, and we'll see if I'll use that for more photo. He really does have 11 cameras. Way too many. All right, man. Thanks, buddy. For that. That, that'd be, it'd be better if I yeah, pressed record. record. This is David Manning, possibly the greatest YouTuber of all time. Wow, wow. Yeah, wow. What, a, what an introduction. Now, this is going to be a real simple question. Okay. What is your current at-home studio camera and lens? Like my A-cam or B-cam? Yeah, A-cam. A-cam is an A7S III still, mm. uh, 16 to 35 G Master on there mm. with a Falcam cage, oh. Falcam handle, Shinoba 7-inch monitor up top, mm -hmm. small rig V-mount battery out back, mm. and a little... Uh, Oh, I'm on the new Alonzi heavy duty tripod now. Oh yeah, that's so I have an F22 mount that comes out with a little magic arm, oh. and then a Tascam X8 running up to a Rode NTG3. Oh, I have the NTG3 too. It Great gives me that bass in my that's voice. Right. Makes me sound like a real man. Yeah, you sound like a broadcaster. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And what about uh, if you're going out taking the snappy snaps, the photos? What's your camera? Ooh, that's tough these days. If it's purely photos, yeah. The Fujifilm. X106 yeah. has been on my hip constantly. See, me too. I love that. We're like thing. we're like brothers. I love this. Yeah. yeah. I'm I'm yeah. just I'm like a We a, look different. I'm an uglier version. Yeah, right. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Thanks David, appreciate it. Thank you, brother. Okay, Anthony. Yep. What is your home studio setup, video camera and lens? So for YouTube, it's actually this one right here, R5 with the 15 to 35 f2.8. Now, sometimes I will switch it out because I also really like using this camera for photos. So sometimes I'll just shoot on the R6. Max is out at 30 minutes, but that's okay because I can get most of my talking head done within that time frame. My follow-up question was, what camera do you use for photos? But you've already answered it. I'm already ahead of you. R5, mostly for photos because of the nice 45 megapixels. Sometimes, if I know I don't need that much resolution, R6 Mark II. It's the most efficient one we've done yet. There you're, we go. You're a champ. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right, we're here with Bronson from the Audio Hotline. Correct. Hot. Yes. This guy's hot and lining. <laughs> that, is, that is true. <laughs> He's yeah. both those things. Now, Bronson, quick question. What is your current studio cam and lens? Okay, so I have too much gear. Yep. Yeah, big old case of gas for sure. Mm -hmm. Main, A7S III, 24 millimeter G Master. B cam, uh, usually ZV E1 with a 35 G Master. Oh, Mr. Fancy G Masters over yeah. here. Now, what about your photo camera? Uh, A74. 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 You know, I usually go with the 24 to 70 Sigma. I like macro stuff, so I do have the 90 millimeter macro Sony G. So, yeah. That's not bad, I guess, for a poor person. I know. You know that's what true. I mean? That's true. This guy. <laughs>
<laughs> Thanks, Bronson. Appreciate it. Thanks, man. Right. Yeah, he's, he's a friend of mine. We've been hanging out yeah, the whole time. I just we're pretending like we don't really, you know, we're a professional interview. I've ruined it now. Yeah, I've okay. ruined, yeah, I've ruined it now. Yeah, every day been hanging out. So cool. <laughs> All right. So, Connor, yes. what is your current video setup, your camera and lens? OK, well, here I'll, I have it on my hip right now. So I'm rocking the Sony a7 R5. I, like I love this camera because it is a solid hybrid between video and photos because mm -hmm. with YouTube, I always have to take a good thumbnail. It's an annoying part of it. Otherwise, I'd probably rock the FX3. And then right now, I have the Sigma uh, 24 to 70, which is uh, the 2.8 art lens. Yes. It's a beautiful little lens. Uh, not quite as expensive as the Sony's. Also, not quite as good, but they are really solid. So. This is a great little setup just for walking around. And what about photography? I use this as well for Same photography. Thing. Same thing. I did have, uh, I have the Nikon ZF on order, mm. so that should be coming soon. Uh, that'll be a great little photo camera, but I do use my A7R5 for pretty much everything. Well, why wouldn't you? Yeah, I know. You know? It's a great camera. Great camera. Yeah. Speaking of that, I believe Terry Warfield just sold everything. You got, you sold the A7 IV to get this, right? I did. Oh, yeah. Let's, let's bring over Terry Warfield. Now, so, so, buddy, what is what is your current studio camera, video camera? Uh, two of them. It's between the ZV-E1 mm. right here and also the Lumix S5 2X. All right. So I use them both. And photo camera? ZF. ZF. ZF and A7R5. Mm -hmm. It's A7R5. Does that get you what you need? Yeah. I think so. I think, I, think, so. I think I get the job done. I think, I think you're doing okay. Yeah, I think so. you're doing okay. Thanks, Terry Warfield. Thanks. We're here with Mark Wemels, who is exactly the same height as me. <laughs> and uh, we're asking him the question of the day. What is your home video camera setup and lens? FX30 with the Sigma 18-35 to 35 adapted, set to about 23, 24 millimeters, depending on the setup that I've got. And then my second camera angle is a ZV-E1, and I think I'm usually running the uh, 20 millimeter 1.8G lens on that. What about photo camera? Uh, my favorite photo camera is the A7 IV, and the A7 IV is probably my favorite camera overall, if I could only have one camera. It's just, as you know, it's so reliable. You just can't beat that camera. And the FX30, I use that for my main camera now. A couple reasons. One is because it's APS-C and I do a lot of APS-C and I want to put my money where my mouth is and just show that it, it will work for anyone. And um, and then that just keeps my A7 IV free to use when whenever I want to use it. Yeah, so you can keep, leave that set up on the tripod, always ready to shoot. Yeah, never moves. Yeah, yeah I yeah, have the yeah. exact same thing because you copied me. Yeah, yeah probably. In fact, I'm sure I did. I'm a big influencer. <laughs> Absolutely. Big. Very tall, yeah. tall <laughs> influencer. Uh, there you go. Just yeah, crouch down for God's sake. This is my video. Hope I have a good answer. Yeah, this is a very complicated question. What is your current video setup? Your studio setup, camera and lens. Favorite one? Um, I'm using a Canon R50 with a Sigma 18 to 35. Look have to that. have the little adapter to make it work. Has to have the adapter to make it work. Yeah. Canon. Oh, that's the first one I've heard Canon. Yeah, yep. of this one. Yeah. Now, what about photo camera? If it's time to go out, take some snappy snaps, what are you choosing? Canon R5. Canon R5. Yeah, with my RF uh, 28 to 80. Uh, that's pretty fancy. Yeah, that's, that's a nice That's pretty lens. fancy. You <laughs> stepped it up for the photos. Well, thanks, Heather. Fellow filmmaker. Just, uh, you know, you already follow her. Of but, course. But follow me. <laughs> We're here with who is Matt Johnson? It is Matt Johnson. Right here is a famous, famous YouTuber. The most famous, probably. Gerald's here. No, he's way more famous than Never I. heard of him. Never heard Never of him. Never heard okay. of him. Now, what is your home, your studio setup, your camera and lens? Sony a7S III, mm -hmm. still. Still. Even though I really like the FX3, and I'm like, dang, they got some really nice updates for it. I should probably do it. But I finally got a firmware update last week. That's true. Finally. Yeah. So, <laughs> a7S III usually has Sony 24 millimeter. Yeah. 24 Tell millimeter G Master 1.4? G Master 1.4. Yeah, that's mine. That's what I got too. It's beautiful. <laughs> and what about photo camera? What's your favorite photo camera? I don't do photos. I think I have my cameras. I'm like, photo? They're like made for some time lapses, but like a lot of my cameras when I sell them, they're like, yeah, it's like a zero shutter count. Congratulations. Yeah. Photos? No. Nah. So there you nah. go, Sony. Get a camera, strip out all those photo features so this guy has something to use. You know what I mean? Yep. And uh, also, how long does it take you to groom that beard in the morning? It's uh, it's all laziness, pure laziness. So about like 30 seconds. Very quick. This is this is Very me growing up. Yep. This is as good as yes. I can do. It's not bad. You're doing it. There thanks. you go. I got some stubble. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Matt.
Loved it. All right, we're here with uh, the second best tech YouTuber of all time, next to me, of course. This is Joe. Oh, I was just say, who's the first best? It's clearly me. My Wait. second channel. <laughs> yes, sir. This is, this is Joe London. It is. We're gonna, we're gonna bother him. We know he hates doing things like this, so we're relishing this right now. I don't care. See, he doesn't even care. Now, what is your current video camera setup, studio, your main camera, and your main lens? It's a Sony a7 IV with a 24-70 G Master II. Yes, now if you ever go out and do photography, what's the camera you take for that? An Alpha 1. An and Alpha that, 1. That's true. I didn't and usually I put the 35 Prime on there. I didn't ask a follow-up about the lens, that's true. This is uh, Gerald Undone. It is. Signing off. I'm signing off? From NAB, yeah. Are you signing off? <laughs> no, it's you. Okay. You've got to close my video. Okay. Also, you have to put affiliate links for my stuff in your, in your video. Back to you, Jim. So there you go, pretty interesting what everybody's using in 2024. Comment down below which YouTuber you dislike the most and I'll be sure to tell them. Thanks for watching this, we'll talk to you again soon. Okay, bye-bye.